Hello, hello, you people in YouTube land. How do you do? Yes, I think I am lost again. But I think I found something very interesting. So, we haven't done this for a few months, haven't we? And so I decided to go to some place, some place that I haven't been to before, a new place for me. So, what I do is, uh, I got on the MRT. This is Lower Salita Reservoir. So we're going to take the MRT to one place. Then we're going to take a bus to another place. And that's the plan so far. And we are on the bus now. Heading to that place we're going to. And while we're on the bus, we're at the other end of Lower Salita Reservoir on the Yishun Dam. And we're going to cross this road here, I guess, this dam. This dam place to look for the place they are looking for. Since we haven't been to be for a walk for a while, I thought we'd go to some place special. Some place unusual. Some place you will not expect to find in around nearby an aerospace park. Yes, over here is the aerospace park. We are also going to pass by Salita Airport to find this place, which is a very unusual place to find in this location. Yes, very unusual indeed. And so, I stopped a few bus stops before, just to have a look around. There seemed to be a small little green area here, a, little, a very little small green area. This is just the size of it. And we are crossing a bridge, a bridge that doesn't have a river underneath it, doesn't have a road, doesn't have anything underneath it. So I guess the bridge is just decoration? Yes, and we have the shelter behind me. And as I was walking around here, I noticed something very interesting in the distance. Something black and white, like a mansion black and white mansion so this area here is called the oval there are a few bars a few restaurants here you know but one thing very interesting is that this place is just along a road in the middle of nowhere I don't see anything around here except for this restaurant and bar so I decided to take a short detour and just look around the area here. And the first thing I noticed is Colonial Mansions. There are quite a few of them around this area here. And unfortunately, a lot of them are vacant. Nobody is renting them. It's empty. But the grounds around it is still maintained. The places seem to be ready for people to rent the walls are painted the windows are kept well you know so i guess people just have to rent them and as i was doing my research i found out that these colonial mansions in the past used to house the british servicemen and their families who work at the RAF at Salita Airport and they used to stay here and they had many facilities like shops you know, petrol stations you know, that serve the community here don't you get I don't know about you but as I was walking around here I get like a very British feel to the area here. Definitely very non-Singapore. This is definitely not something that you can find in Singapore often. But here it is. It has a British feel. But a British feel that is probably maybe 50 to 100 years in the past. And 
I guess we should continue our journey to our location that we're looking for, a very natural location, which is a bit unique to find in a aerospace industrial area. And across the street, you'll notice there are more colonial mansions, but these colonial mansions seem to be uh, occupied. Somehow people like to stay on the other side of the street and not on this side of the street. Yep, so I'm heading that direction there. Wait a minute. Am I lost? Am I getting lost? Anyway, I think I found it. Yes, this area here looks very natural. So let's go in and have a look. First of all, they planted some nice flowers here. And it just rained recently. So all the what the plants here are all well watered. And this is where we are going to. We are at the Hampstead Wetlands Park. Yes, Wetlands Park. So at the front here, there are lots of plants they planted here. They landscape the place very nicely, like this orchid. And you have some old trees here. And past the bushes here, in the distance is the place we are looking for. Can you see it? To my left, there's a small little forested area. You can actually walk in the forested area. Uh, there's a nature walk there. You can just explore it. But I'm going to walk further down here to show you the place that I'm looking for. An unusual place because you must remember, this is an industrial area, an aerospace park area, and Slita Airport is nearby. And then also you have all these old colonial buildings, an old residential area. And right smack in the middle of it, you have this. Yeah, this. Can you see it? So, it's a small little pond, a freshwater pond with lily pads. I think lotus pads, sorry. And there are even fishes in there. They look like koi, doesn't it? I saw a turtle earlier. And then this is a freshwater pond with lots of reeds at the side there. Look at this. Surrounded by trees. So there are no rivers feeding this pond here. So all the water that comes in here actually comes from the rain. So rain will fall on the trees here and it will trickle down here and then the reed system, the, the plant system here will help to filter the water. And look, I think these are cocoons. Cocoons for dragonflies. Isn't that interesting? So. What happens is, the water flows in here, then the reeds and the plants at the side there will filter the water, and that's why you get fresh water in here, fresh enough to support dragonflies. And if you listen properly, you can hear the sound of birds chirping. This is definitely a very unusual natural space to find in this area here, especially with Slita Airport just nearby. Look at that. Just, just, just look at that. Something you don't usually find.
So what you can see here first of all is the freshwater pond here and the trees behind there on this side here an uh, old colonial building over there the main road where cars and trucks pass by colonial buildings again the trees lining the road then in the distance the aerospace park so this place here very unusual not something that should exist but national parks created this place here and i'm really glad they did because this place here is definitely 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 one of the one it's very picturesque it's very natural it's not something that you expect to find in this area here but here it is why they put it here i do not know but it is nice it is beautiful it is serene it is watery natural and these are some of the old colonial buildings then in front of there behind it that that place is the aerospace park the industrial area and then over there is where the Hampstead wetland park is I just have to say this this place here an unusual find I'm glad I came here to look for it even though it is a bit unique a bit abandoned because a lot of these places here nobody is staying at this place at the moment but still very very interesting I hope you enjoyed this getting lost adventure where we explore this place here Hampstead wetland park a very very interesting place a remote place a place you don't expect to find a park especially a wetland park and I definitely enjoyed looking for it and finding it and you know what to do like share and subscribe it helps to grow this channel so please do that also you can also support me by patreon I got PayPal you can support me there also watch some of my old videos I visited a lot of food centers and explore the hawker food there you be you may be interested in that and lastly but the most important thing the thing that you have to do is to join me for my next adventure i will see you all around bye bye